I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is Seeds We Eat. So I'm going to come right here in the center of my paper. I'm going to put a dot. And from that dot, I'm going to draw a circle. Then on top of the circle, I'm going to draw one, two straight lines. Below, one, two. On the right, one, two straight lines. And on the left, one, two straight lines. Now, starting on this section right here, I'm going to go in between and draw one, two straight lines, come down, one, two straight lines, come over, one, two straight lines, and come over one more time, one, two straight lines. I come right up here to the first set, and I'm going to draw a pretty good sized circle. Come to the next one, draw another pretty good sized circle. Work your way around the whole entire part, making a pretty good sized circle. Come over here on the left, we're going to do it again. Come up and draw a pretty good sized circle. Come over, up, around, draw a pretty good sized circle. Keep going, and one more. Pretty good size circle. Okay, inside my first circle, I'm going to write seeds, S-E-E-D-S, -E -E seeds, we, W-E, eat, E-A-T. Seeds, we, eat. Good. Starting right here on this one, circle over here first. The first thing I'm going to do is draw a curved line. Come back to the left. Straight diagonal down on the left. Straight diagonal down on the right. Come back to the left. Slightly curved line. Little straight line. Slightly curved line. Little straight line connect. Inside I'm just going to draw one straight line and another straight line. Come over here on the left, draw a slightly curved line, jump over, slightly curved line, connect. Inside, I'm going to put some little dots because the first seed that we eat is rice. R-I-C-E, rice. Now I come over to this circle on top, I put a dot. From the dot, I'm going to draw a big curve line over, in, up, and connect. I'm going to put a couple of dots on the inside. And this seed that we eat is a bean, or beans, B-E-A-N. I'll put an S, more than one, beans, okay? Now I come down to the next circle. I draw a straight diagonal line, zigzag, 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 straight diagonal line down. Let's just put one, two straight lines inside. Now I go curve line, curve line, curve line, curve line, connect, curve line, curve line, connect. I put a little curve line and then do a little curve line, curve line, connect, little curve line. Curve line, curve line, connect. Little curve line, curve line, curve line, connect. This next seed that we eat is popcorn. P-O-P-C-O-R-N. Popcorn. Okay? Now I come down to my next circle. Put a dot. Inside, I'm going to draw another circle. Inside that, I put another dot, and I'm going to draw another circle. This is a bagel. And on top 
of the bagel, I'm going to put little teeny tiny dots. And these are the seeds that we eat on top of bagels. And those are poppy, P-O-P-P-Y, poppy seeds that people eat all the time on top of their bagels. Come down to the next circle. Put a dot. Draw a big curve line out on the left. Come back to the dot. Big curve line out on the right. Come up on top. Curve line, curve line, curve line, connect. And out here, curve line, curve line, curve line, connect. Big curve line down, down, and down. On the sides, I'm just going to draw a little curve line, connect, connect, connect. These are the seeds, and they are pumpkin seeds. P U M. P K I N seeds and we eat the pumpkin seeds also. Now I come down to this circle right here, put a dot. We're going to draw a flat oval. And then on top we're going to draw a curved line, keep going, curved line, curved line, keep going all the way around. Keep going. And if you have room, you can fill in with another little curved line because we want this to be a full flower. Two straight lines going down. In the big flat oval, we put more seeds because these are sunflower, S-U-N-F-L-O-W-E-R, sunflower seeds. We eat those too. Now I come over to the next one, put a dot, curve line down, curve line up, connect, put a dot, curve line down, curve line up, connect, one more if you have room, put a dot, curve line down, curve line up, connect. Inside, I'm just going to put one, two, three, one, two, three, two, three little straight lines. These are almonds, A-L-M-O-N-D-S, and they represent nuts, N-U-T-S, that we also eat that are seeds, nuts. Okay, the last circle right here at the top, put a dot. We're going to draw a curve line down, curve line up, curve line out down, connect. In this little section right here, baby circles, as many as you can fit, and those seeds are peas. P-E-A-S. And we all eat peas also. Okay? So we have beans, popcorn, poppy seeds, pumpkin seeds, sunflower seeds, almonds and nuts, and peas and rice. Okay, now let's see how we're going to color this in. Okay, to color this in real simple, I'm going to start with my rice and all I'm going to do is put a little blue line. That's all. I come over to my beans, or my bean I should say, and I'm going to color this light brown. Okay. I come over to my popcorn and really I'm just going to put some red lines on my box, so you know that's a popcorn box. And I'm going to take yellow, and I'm going to color in my popcorn yellow. I come down to my bagel, and I'm going to color that a light brown. You could do this yellow or apricot if you have those colors. Leave the poppy seeds the way they are. Come down to my pumpkin. Do the top part green and this little ruffle part green and then do the pumpkin orange and leave the seeds white because that's the color they are for pumpkin seeds come to my sunflower lightly color the center black and if you have room for your stock you can do that green 
come next to my nuts, my almonds, I'm just going to color light brown. And my peas, I'm going to do the peas, the actual pea seeds, these darker green, and then the shell or that they're sitting in a lighter green. Now, I used yellow to color in the spokes for seeds we eat. If you want to use a different color, this is when you can get creative. Okay? Alright, let's see what this looks like all colored in. Okay, here's my chart finished of seeds we eat. And it's a good way to remember all the different types of seeds that we do eat. Okay, bye-bye.